getting some tree work done today. I'm actually gonna have these mulberries, as you can see, these mulberries are kind of hanging over the shed and over this little garden area here. They fall down into this little garden. But there's uh, several of them back there. There's a couple two trunkers. See, and there's a larger one on the right hand side. Right there. But we're getting these done today. Should be, uh, shouldn't be too bad for the tree fellers. But uh, we'll see how it goes. Stop. Here's the trimmings right here. They're making some pretty good headway, looks like. It'll be all right. It'll come. It'll bounce back. It'll buff out. It'll bounce back. Yeah, it'll buff out. Yeah. Sorry about that. 
It's hard to control. fellers have completed their operation of removing those trees. Let's take a look at how they did now. here that we have here 
and you can see they didn't destroy this bush. This is a bush that I received from uh, some colleagues when my mom passed away, so it's kind of special. But you can see the ground is fairly decent shape. And you can see they cut the stumps. They cut the stumps down very, very nice. Low enough to the ground. If I want them lower, I can, I can cut them lower myself. As you can see. The one tree left that's kind of questionable is this maple. And this maple is... Uh, Kind of growing between the power line there so that's going to take a little bit of thought process and maybe reconsidering removing that i think it'll be fine for the next 20 years 30 years maybe somebody else can deal with it but uh, as you can see they did a pretty decent job clearing everything out without destroying anything they didn't hit the shed. They did take the wire down a little bit, but it just detached from the house at the safety area and they were able to put that back up. And they actually put that wire back up a lot better than it was. As you can see, it's higher now. It's not uh, resting on the shed, which is uh, what I didn't like. But uh, looks good now. A look at the garden above uh, on the top of the hill as you can see there's a little bit of it that's laid over but I think that'll be fine once we get a little rain or if we water it it'll it'll snap back and it'll be fine so thanks for watching the video and we'll catch you on the next one